Hello. So last we left here, my name's Laura, and I want to know more about Docker. So here's a tutorial. Let me check this out. And then, so to explain, an image is a self-contained file that is used to install something or build something. It's, it has all the files in it. It's kind of like a zip file, but it has a special e extension that relates to whatever it has to build or install, such as Microsoft uses .iso files to install software on Microsoft if it's an image file. It's a .iso. So here in Docker, which Docker itself is a self-contained space. That's why it's called Docker. <laughs> Easy to remember, right? So, no vulnerabilities were detected. Okay. Now, we went through all of this yesterday. This is what it gave us, was four images. In Docker, they have it set up this way. So, if you don't see this, it's not an official Docker image in case it's claiming to be and you don't see it this way. So let's see what we have here. Uh, we have a bunch of files. 18. Okay, lines of code, right? Okay, let's take a look here. Volume, one volume. And container, two containers. Dev environment run a single container. Oh, I can't remember. I don't have the name of it. Okay, we're not going to do that. Escape. Okay, let me see if I can get this to open up. Oh, look. Harpoon Docker extension for no-code Kubernetes platform. Hmm. I'm not sure what this means. Interesting. Wow, there's a lot of stuff. Look at all these categories. Ooh, this will take a while to go through, huh? Look at this. Dive in. Akita API extension, new man, postman. Hmm. Well, it looks rather interesting. You know, I kind of think you could probably create a video about each one of these. And that will keep you busy for a long, long time, which is good. Especially if you don't know anything about each one. So let's pick one. Let's see. Oh, Red Hat. Mm, hold on. All right. Um, I'm going to do this one. Oh, now when it installs, it's installing inside of Docker. And I'm really new at this, so I can make mistakes. You can correct me, of course. Please do. Nobody's perfect. <laughs> Let's have fun together. So, it's installing. Yay! So it's important to uh, 
you know, at, for me, it's important to advertise things at real time. I could probably cut this out and put a transition in there, which I know I could, but I'm going to let it run, I think. If I don't, well, let's see. If I don't change my mind. <laughs> oh, 5.2K is how big it is. Well, that's not very big. Hmm. It's not. <laughs> it's still installing. Ah, well, maybe I will take this part out, right? <laughs> So, I wonder in the comments who is interested in using Docker, what brought you here to my website, or my, you know, YouTube channel. I really don't have, I have 25, 28, 28 subscribers. I wish I could say hello to each one. Um... Oh, here we go. So I would have to turn this on and let you see it too, which might be against copyright. So I'm not going to do that. So that's what will open up if you go there. Well, that was just an introduction to a few things in Docker once again. So we shall click on some other items next time in Docker. Have a great day. Happy New Year.